What is up, guys? I'm super stoked right now. Check out what I just did to my Prover. XL4030. It's not even a Prover 30 anymore. I don't even know what it would be. I, I think... It's like 400 millimeter by 300 millimeter was the old thing. So this is like a, a 150, 100, I guess. Yeah, the Prover XL. No, the Prover XXL freaking 150, 100. There we go. <laughs> so I thanks to some other guy, I don't know his channel's name, but uh, he upgraded his to like the thousand by a thousand millimeter. Uh, I had to go a step above that. You know, I wanted to be able to knock out big signs all in one shot. So I did the 1500 millimeter long, which comes out to about five feet, I think. I think that's 1500. And then uh, a thousand millimeter, which is like 3.3 feet, I think. So this thing is nice and big. I got to finish working on my table. Um, I didn't buy enough two by fours. I got to get some center center supports in there. But I I just wanted to record a video because I'm super happy, super stoked, super ready. I keep saying super. At least it's not the word um. So we'll, we'll roll with it. Anyways. I took a bunch of pictures while I was uh, disassembling my machine and, and putting the other one back, you know, the other parts back. Well, I didn't really do the Z axis. I guess it'd be the, not necessarily, it would be the X axis. I didn't take any pictures doing the X axis, but I did doing one of the Ys. Um, it's basically the same thing um, altogether, taking it apart and everything. But I mean, if you put your machine together, you probably figure it out. Cool thing was uh, the C beams came pre-threaded. This uh, small one, I went a little cheap. I got this small little bar for the bottom. I'm not gonna use it where I have it right now. Sorry, I'm all over the place with this camera. Um, I'm actually just gonna tack this down to the table once I get the tabletop, and then put my spoil board on that. Probably gonna have to get something, some sort of support for the middle. Cross that road once we get there. But if you want to see a video of me taking this apart and putting it together, I'll put all the links and everything like that for where you can do this yourself as well. And then I'll, uh, I'll do some more videos with it and whatnot. Just let me know if you guys have anything, any specific questions in the comments. I'll be more than happy to answer them. But... That's all I really wanted to show you guys. Uh, I got this table. Excuse all the junk there. It's, uh, you know, all the parts, all the wires and stuff like that. I still got to wire it up. Uh, plus, uh, I need to get my motor back on here. I uh, broke off the head of the... Hold on, let me show you this. Uh, this isn't the one, but, you know, will it focus? There we go. The little head of the little tiny allen key freaking broke off in my set screw so i uh i went today and i bought some but i left it i took my wife's van to go pick up the wood and i forgot them in there and she's out right now so i will put the stepper motor on later after i can uh you know put the uh the flexible coupling back together and then tonight i'm gonna get this all wired up and then make a run to the store and get get the uh the tabletop the spoil board and some center supports for my my table here um plus i need some some cross support so i'm probably gonna pick up maybe like probably three more two by fours do some legs and then two you know just a cross beam on the back side and on the front so that's all